my computer is dirty. <laughs> Sorry, guys, I had to wipe my laptop screen because, as always, it's a mess like me. <laughs> What's up, everybody? So good to see you. So I'm going to wait for some people to get here because I have some super exciting things to talk about right now. If you guys have not watched my recent video, go ahead and watch that because I sat in this very chair back here communicating with who I think was the entity of my voodoo doll that is in L.A. currently still there. But you guys can kind of see what I have got going on in the background here. And this is my new prized possession. So I'll be telling you guys the story about her because this is so wild how I found her. Um, but let me say hi to some of you guys right quick. Um, okay. So hello, Sherry. So good to see you, Brie, Olivia, um, Alexis. So here. Hi. Thanks for coming. And of course, Jackson. We have Caitlin, Starlight. Hi. Tatiana, Amy, Adriana. Um, say what's up guys. Hello, Kristen B, Carissa, Christine Brown, Valerie. Oh my God. Okay. The comments. Yeah, 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 yeah. Say hi guys. Say hi. Um, Kenna, Karen, Ramiro. Oh man. What is up everybody? Definitely feeling the love here, guys. Go live on TikTok. Yes, I have to start doing that. So if you guys are not following me on TikTok, that is where I post, except I've been taking a little bit of a break on TikTok the past like week or two. That's typically where I post all of my haunted paranormal experiences like right away. So if you guys don't want to wait for a YouTube video, go ahead, follow me over there. So, um, okay. <laughs> I have so much to tell you, but definitely I am absolutely out of my mind and you will see why that thing back there, right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I, uh, might have a few regrets and um, let's see. Let's see. Happy birthday, Alexandra. Is that how you say your name? Alexandra. Hello, Valerie. Wilbur. Hi. And holy crap, he looks scary as fuck. Yeah. Um, I think it's a girl, but yeah, we're going to talk about that. So I'm going to go ahead and if you guys are familiar with the live streams that I've done in the past with my crystal shop, every single person that purchases on tonight's live stream will be entered in to win a ton of goodies guys i have like loads of free crystals here and they are like some really 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 good crystals um and then aside from that after this live stream is over i'm keeping the video up and i will be giving away a massive crystal and that goes for anybody if you purchase or not so when this video is over all you have to do is comment your email down below in the comments and i will be choosing a winner tomorrow um so i just need your email so i can contact you but I do have my phone here. And as always, I will be able to get the notifications for when I get some orders. But I wanted to share something really quick with you guys. So if you didn't watch my video yesterday, I talked about a cat named Oliver. So if you guys didn't know, I help support a colony, a cat colony in California with 37 cats. A cat named Oliver was recently shot with a BB gun and we're trying to raise money for him. Every single cat crystal that you guys see in my store goes directly to helping feed and save those cats. So I will pin my crystal shop here for you guys and again as always every single order that is placed i will be writing your guys's names down in my handy dandy trusty let that shit go notebook if you guys remember my um healing boxes i can't remember if that's what this was when i first started my crystal shop but um yeah i'll write your name down and then we'll throw them in jack's box and we'll pick some winners so let me let me do this really quick i cannot multitask shop my crystals here but it's so good to see you guys i missed you and i'm so sorry i have not been on live in like forever you can leave that on yeah all right let me it's so hot in my room right now but i think like every single time i'm back here with my dolls i just get really overwhelmed so i'm gonna go ahead and pin my crystal shop here it is also in the description of this video and i would really really love to know if you guys purchased from my crystal shop. So let me know in the comments really quick. And then we're going to get into talking about these dolls. We have 111 people here. 111. Those are definitely numbers I've been seeing a lot. Um, can't wait until I can order your crystals. Hell yeah, Izzy. I'm excited for you to get some crystals because you're going to love them. I can pick everything. And guys, every single crystal order gets freebies. You literally get freebies in every single order. And I handpick those freebies. So go live on TikTok now. Um, yeah, things are doing good, Leticia. Good to see you. Do you have any crystals that can be dyed? I personally don't sell crystals that are dyed. I only sell authentic crystals. 
So I know I don't have any of those. Um, you're on the right path. Exactly. Yes, yes. So ACDC, I, I picked this shirt up from a thrift store, so I'm really excited about it. Um, okay, so I'm actually, before we get into the dolls, I'm going to show you guys some of the crystals that I'm giving away tonight. So I've been saving these because I have some like really massive crystals here. Like this crystal right here is huge and it's really special to me. I was going to keep it for myself, but I want to give it to you guys. This is an amethyst moon and star etched tower. So you can actually kind of see through it. But this one I'm giving away. So if you guys purchase from my store, you will be entered into win at the end of this live stream. My other half. Hi, Tiffany. I miss you. I miss you so much. It hurts. It literally hurts. Um, so this one I will be giving away. Yeah, 333 for me as well, Sherry. And then I'm going to be giving away this Sodalite and Angel Aura uh, crystal tree. You guys really seem to like these. I gave these out to my Patreons uh, kind of recently. And then we have a little fluorite tree as well that we're going to be giving away. Um, and then I have some crystal bracelets. Let's see. Crystal bracelets and um, a moss agate tower. And guys, this one's my favorite. This is from my personal collection. Just let you know. Just let you know. Um, and then we have a little green... Um, green jade turtle. Look how cute he is. And we already have an order. So let me shout out whoever ordered. And then I'm going to start writing your guys' names down. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the little kitty crystals that you can purchase that go directly towards helping save Oliver's life. Again, Oliver is the cat that I helped support from the cat colony who was recently shot with a BB gun. He will lose his leg if we can't get him a surgery. So hoping to sell out of the cat crystals at least so that we can help him out and I can send the rescue all of the monies. So anyway, thank you guys that have purchased because I got quite a few orders today and a lot of them are for the cat crystals. And then at the end of this live stream, you don't have to purchase. This is not this like anybody. I'm giving away this massive amethyst and aura crystal tree. And I love these. I have so many of these. And I was like, you know what? Let me let me give these away. These are actually not for sale in my store yet. I have not put, listed those. Yes, animals got to be loved and cared and protected for. Absolutely. You would love that soda light tree. Yes, so the soda light is, is really pretty because it's all different variations of the, the blue in here. Sometimes soda light is like one solid blue. But in this case. All right. So let me see who just purchased. And then we're going to get into these dolls because guys, <laughs> that, that, that doll back there, I'm telling you, there is something up with it. And I got it from like one of the most haunted stores I've ever been in. Okay. So shout out to Christine B. We have my girl, Christine. She has purchased from my store quite a few times. I do recognize people that purchase. And again, guys, every order gets freebies. So I'm going to go ahead and write Christine down. Are they rare? Um, how much are my crystals? So the link is here in the chat as well as in the description. So if you go to the website, you'll see all of the prices with the different crystals and descriptions and what they do. Okay, so we got Christine Brown. Let's do Christine B. Yeah, we got these two little um, bracelets that I'm also giving away, a carnelian and a black tourmaline. Black tourmaline is super powerful for protection as well. So how much do they cost? So the prices of everything will be in my crystal store. If you just click on the link, you'll be able to see all of the crystals that are for sale and the prices. So let's show you guys. Oh, we got another order really quick. I'm going to show you guys the little kitty crystals that are all going towards the rescue. So shout out to Mary Kay. Um, and she did purchase one of the little kitty crystals. Yay. I'm so happy. Oh, and Christine also purchased some of the kitty crystals as well. So we got Mary Kay. Mary Kay. So let's see. Where are the little kitty cat crystals? You guys, I have a lot of crystals here and I'm going to just like do a little preview for you guys and then we're going to pull them out. <gasps> okay. So we have rose quartz and clear quartz little kitty cats. So again, guys, these are going directly towards helping save the cat, the Oliver, their cat's life. He has to go in for surgery on Wednesday. So if we can get all of these sold that might be like a huge chunk of money that we can put towards his surgery. So here are the little kitty cat crystals. We have rose quartz. I'm dyslexic. 
we have rose quartz and we have clear quartz. And then I also have a few cat paw crystals left, which I think you guys will absolutely love. These are almost sold out. You guys are really showing the love with these. So we have a rose quartz kitty cat paw print and an opalite kitty cat paw print. And there's a few of these left. So again, guys, giving away tons and tons of crystals. So whoever purchases during this live stream, I will be writing your name down and picking a name out of Jack's box like always. So let's see. I'm going to read some of your comments. I want you guys to be able to see this doll right here, actually. I'm going to see if I can move her so that you guys can see. She is, uh, I don't want her to fall. There we go. How wild is this, guys? Like, look at my setup. I'm in the most haunted part of my house. This, this part of my house is truly the most haunted. This is where shit pops off every single night. Happy birthday to you, Emmy. Yeah, she is. She's definitely the biggest doll I have ever, ever owned. Um, yeah, all of my crystals um, are hand selected, guys. Some are rare, some are common crystals. I like to have a lot of the basics, but I like to have some pretty rare crystals as well. Um, we just got another order. So let's see. Who are we shouting out? Valerie S. Valerie S. Yeah, oh, okay. Valerie S. purchased the little um, Jersey Blue Heart. So we got Valerie. I love doing this with you guys. I miss this so much. Like, remember when I used to go live at least once a week and we give away tons of crystals in California, like sitting there on the grass or on the pavement getting eaten by bugs? Okay, I'm gonna show you guys a couple of my favorite pieces. <laughs> Why does it give me poltergeist vibes? What, the little girl or which one? Because there's a lot going on here. <laughs> Welcome everybody that is just joining, like the clown doll in the movie. Oh my God. Yes. Yes. So I'm going to show you guys a couple of my favorite pieces. I believe that this one is still for sale. Um, we just got another order. I'll read that in a second. But this is super, super rare uh, amethyst from Uruguay. I don't know how to pronounce that. Please don't, you know. Why does it have better hair than me, Tiffany? That ain't even a fact. Um, but this is a very, very high quality amethyst. You can tell by the deep purple um, and just the cut of it in general. It's a cut base, basically just meaning that they cut it and turn it into like, it kind of looks like a, a freaking bookmarker. I don't know. Um, but it's just a certain type of cut of amethyst. I had other ones of these. These also sold. So there's only one piece of this. Super, super rare. Um, and that's like one of my favorite pieces. It's so beautiful. I have one of these rose quartz elephants left. These sold out pretty quickly. You guys bought up all of my pink amethyst. Let me know if you guys want me to restock these elephants. Um, as you can see, it is quite large. So we have one more of these. Then I'm going to show you guys a super high vibrating crystal. And these are the Angel Aura Fire and Ice Quartz Towers. You can see them. Like, do you see the rainbow on these guys? Like, how is this even real? This is unreal. How does the earth make this? How does the earth make this? Do you see that? Like, what in the freaking world? What in the world? I think I only have like four of these left. So if you guys are liking those, then you got to go grab them soon. Then this is... Oh, one second. We got two orders. Shout out to Brianna N., and oh my goodness, let's see. We got my girl D, my girl Dina, and she got some of the cat paw crystals, some kitty cats, and the honeycomb ruby towers. So thank you, D. I really appreciate that. I saw your other order as well. So you're really gonna love them, little kitty cats. I know you like, you know, you and your cats and all of that were very much the same. So we got D. Then we got Brianna N. You guys are really like helping out a, a really big cause right now because these cats really need us. And I don't know if you guys know, but I used to work for the very, I used to volunteer for the very, very high kill shelters of New York City. And my cat Kai is from there. And it, it was really hard having to raise money and, you know, just seeing what they go through in the shelters. These cats do have a little bit more free reign because they are strays, but they do get hit by cars. People still attack them. Like this cat that was shot with a freaking BB gun. So Christina L. So let's see. You got Brianna got kitty cat crystal and Christina L got 
oh my goodness, got one of my favorite pieces, actually. I'm going to show you guys that right quick. And she got the Cherry Blossom and the Jersey Flower Aggie Cherry Blossom Crystal. She didn't get this exact one. This exact one is still available. Do you see that? They call it Cherry Blossom because some of these actually look like little cherry blossom trees or like little flower trees. So this one is still available. But again, here are the little paw print crystals that are available to purchase and little kitty cat crystals. Aren't these so cute? The fact that I used to have a doll that looked just like that, but she didn't have clown makeup. So yes, I love it so much. Can't wait to receive my order. I'm really excited for you. You guys are going to love these. Like I said, I, I put a lot of love and energy into handpicking every single crystal to make sure that they're all perfect for you guys. David, what is up? So good to see you. Happy birthday to Maria. Reading some of your comments here. How much money do you spend on the dolls? So this doll right here, uh, I don't know what to call her. Maybe we'll call her Shirley because I guess I'll tell you guys now um, and a huge shout out to the 140 people that are here right now. Um, this is a vintage, ironically, a vintage Shirley Temple doll from the 1940s. Now, wild story behind this doll. I got it. Oh my God, look at her eye. Look at her eye. I got it from a thrift store, which is one of my favorite thrift stores in the country in New Hope, PA, which is only like an hour away from me. And it's called Love Saves Love Love Saves Today. If you guys are ever in New Hope, PA or just in PA, you got to venture out to uh, Love Saves Today. Well, this is a vintage 1940s Shirley Temple doll. She got burned. You can see her cheeks. So the owner decided to turn her into something to not let her go to waste and turned her into a clown. So her original hair is underneath the clown wig and she has her original dress underneath this dress. But weirdly enough, this red dress that you see is the owner of Love Saves the Day's childhood dress. So she put this dress on from her childhood on this doll. And this is like a life-size doll. This is the size of a small child. This is the size of a kid. She was $75, just so you guys know. Um, I don't, oh, come on, Shirley. I don't spend like a ton of money getting antiques and stuff. I try to find like good deals. If things are just outrageously expensive. Ew, what is her? I don't like to spend money too much, guys. I'm pretty, uh, I don't know how to explain it. I just, I just don't. Look at her eye. Oh my God. Should I just leave her like that? Libby, how are you? So good to see you. Am I selling my t-shirt? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, it is mine. Um, has the voodoo doll been causing problems? Yeah, Shauna. So if you go watch my recent video I just posted last night, full spirit box session with who I believe I'm communicating with the, the voodoo doll. So guys, go check that video out because it is a good one. I'm going to read some of the orders that just came through right quick. And again, if you guys are just joining, if you purchase from my crystal shop, I will be giving away a ton of crystals tonight. So you have a chance to win a ton of crystals. And then hang tight for the end of this live stream. I'll be choosing the winners. And then also when this video is over, go comment your email down below in the comments because I will be picking a winner to send a large crystal tree to. I'll be doing that tomorrow. Okay. So we have, oh my gosh, guys, we have quite a few orders right now. Let's see. We have crystal. Love your name. We have crystal. Crystal B. Crystal B got a little cat paw crystal and we have Sandra M got a kitty cat crystal guys you might actually sell me out of these cat crystals and if we do I I truly would just appreciate you guys forever because again all the proceeds from these 100% goes towards the cats and I will be consistently doing this just to kind of like help feed and, and TNR them uh, spay and neuter but with this for this week, we have a, a hurt cat that was shot with a BB gun. So definitely have to make sure that he gets his treatment and the funds for it. Um, and we got my girl, Sherry D. So Sherry got two crystal towers, moss agate grown with pyrite and a honeycomb ruby tower. And shout out to the 150 starlings that we have here currently. 
And I'm going to show you guys the dolls in the back in just a moment. I'm like, I don't even want to touch that, that fucking thing. Yeah, I know. I'm absolutely insane. Um, is it Kenna or Kenna? Is that how you say it? We both got K's. And Kenna got a cat paw crystal as well. And one of the rainbow aura crystals. You're really going to love that. So we got Kenna C. All right. Thank you guys so much for the orders. I can't wait to pull names. And we got my girl, Caitlin. So huge shout out to Caitlin. We got another order, Brixie, Brixie H. So Brixie H. And let's see. Brixie H. And we got my girl, Caitlin. Okay read some of your comments here. I'm a huge fan. I had a bad dream about your voodoo doll. You are not the first person to tell me that. That really concerns me. <sighs> I've been hearing a lot of that. How can I find out when you restock? I used to get notifications from Etsy. Yeah. Um, so that's a really good question. People don't get notified now with my Shopify account, but every restock, I do send out emails for restocks. So if you go to the website right in the center, if you scroll down in the center, it'll have like a spot for your email. If you put your email in every time I restock it, I'll send out an email for the restocks and then that's how you'll be notified. But yeah, it doesn't, doesn't do the same thing as uh, my Etsy used to do, unfortunately. So Haley, anybody who purchases right now will be entered into win one of the many crystals I'm giving away. But when this live stream is over, I will be giving away a large crystal tree to anybody who leaves their email down below in the comments of this live stream when the live stream is over. And that is for anybody so that you don't have to purchase. That'll be one exclusive giveaway for everybody. Okay. I'm going to go grab the devil's doll. Let me know if you guys want to see me do some TikToks with these dolls as I'm showing you. Um, I'd love to do that. I think I'm going to try to see if any of these are haunted. So with this doll right here, I, I don't feel anything right now. It doesn't mean that there's not something there. But with that devil doll in the back, that is a vintage doll. And there is an artist in PA that turns dolls into different things like devils and sh weird shit like that with wax. So I'm going to show you a close up really quickly of that doll so that you guys can see. Surely you're going to have to step back for just a moment. Oh. Stand on your two feet, little lady. Okay. Oh, and guys, I also got this. This doll is absolutely insane. And with this one, I feel like there is something attached to it. So let me know if you guys know who Charlie Chaplin is. This is probably a 1920s or 1930s vintage, like antique Charlie Chaplin doll. Latest. And this is incredibly toxic. There's like asbestos in this. I have to get like a glass case to make sure my cat is like nowhere near it. So... Where do I put them? Ah. Yeah, I, I, I swear it just sounded like something moved back here. Or I'm losing it. Okay. Ah. That dog really gives me the creeps. Um, shout out to Marcelli for purchasing some cat crystals. We got Marcelli. Um, let me just write down. I just want to make sure I don't miss any names here, guys. Again, if you're just joining anybody that purchases during this live stream, gets entered into win a ton of crystals I'm giving away. Um, and again, all the kitty cat crystals go towards the cat that we are trying to get surgery for this week. So we got Marcel. Did I say that right? Oh, it's Maricel. That's definitely what it is. Maricel. That's a nice name. So, um, okay. So if you're not following me on TikTok, guys, definitely go give me a follow 
at it's Chris star on everything, Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. I will be doing a little investigation with some of these dolls to see if there's anything up with them. You kind of love the devil doll. It's like a creepy kind of cute. Yeah. That's it. like was the first thing I saw when I walked in. So it's called the creeper gallery and their back room has items that are so haunted that they are all for sale. Some are still under investigation. Some are deemed too dangerous. Like this the uh, antique death mask. And there's also a cursed Ouija board that is deemed too dangerous and has been hurting people. Um, and we're talking like severe demonic possession. That back room made me feel so ill. Everybody that went back there said the, the same thing. I don't know if I've ever been in a space, especially such a tiny space where that much activity, negative activity was happening. It was really disturbing. And I don't typically feel that disturbed. I feel like at this point, I'm a little desensitized to things, but being around that much energy just was sickening. I was nauseous. I was dizzy. Um, wow, you have a good team now. It's reassuring. <laughs> so meet Devil Girl or Devil Doll. This is a vintage and antique doll and an artist crafted her into a devil baby doll with wax. So unfortunately, like the lighting here is not too well, but you can see the different uh, colored wax that was melted to pour over her body. And then, you know, they created the little horns there and it even covers her eyes. So her eyes are waxed. The shit I do. The shit I do. What am I doing? <laughs> and then I wonder why I'm woken up every single night. No, for the most part, guys, I will say the energy in my house is pretty at bay. The only thing I am concerned about is the entity from the voodoo doll that has been coming to me on multiple occasions. And that situation will be figured out. For the most part, I do understand the energy that I'm working with because I am incredibly sensitive to it. I am able to feel and pick up on them. Um, like I know exactly who Hansel and Gretel are, the spirit attached to Scratch. We all know Jack. We all know Jackie boy. Um, just got here. Did you get, get him at an antique shop? I did. Yes. Um, we have another order here. We have, Oh, Oh guys, we have a ton of crystal orders. So hang tight really quick. Um, Oh my God, you guys are blowing my mind right now. I am so, so grateful because, Oh my God, the lady at the cat rescue is going to cry. Like when I tell her she don't cry, <laughs> I'm going to cry. The fact that we can save cats and animals, like all of us guys, like the fact that we can do that is so incredibly special to me because, you know, obviously being a YouTuber and having some sort of like influence and pull publicly, I feel like there should be more, like more should be done to kind of help out other people and animals. And I've always wanted to be someone that can give back to animals. And I've worked with animals for years. I've worked with shelters. Um, I've always rescued cats. Me and my mom, you know, we always took cats in. And I don't know. I just, I know so many of you guys love animals. And I remember saying when I started my crystal shop, I want to be able to give like 10% of my proceeds or sell certain crystals and give the all the proceeds to whatever organization. And I'm doing it. And I'm finally doing it. And it, I'm just, I'm grateful. I'm grateful to be able to do that. So thank you guys so much. So we have Lisa R. So shout out to Lisa. Lisa has purchased before. And Lisa got kitty cat crystal. And we got Melissa. Oh, Melissa or Melissa. It might be Melissa, but you spell it a very interesting way. I like that. Melissa sounds cool too. So we got... Cool. Okay. We have a couple more orders here. We have Shayla again. If you guys purchase multiple times, I will be putting your name down twice. I swear I can't breathe right. Like I'm having pains in my chest and I think it's the porcelain doll because it has asbestos in it. Um, Shayla, Shayla S. And we got Timothy N. Tim M. Oh, guys, I also have these hematite rings. A lot of you guys always ask. This is a like a full crystal right here, and this is used to absorb negative energy. It's cool because when it when it's done absorbing the negative energy, they will break. They're meant to break. And mine broke 
recently and I had been wearing it for like six months. And I was like, ah, finally, because I had released so many things from my life that were weighing me down and a lot of negative emotions and <clears throat> experiences and stuff like that. And it was like that week I kind of let go of everything and the, the freaking ring broke. It was very telling of the, the work that these crystals or the power that these crystals hold. Okay, so maybe that breathing is someone who died of asbestos. Yeah, I don't know. I just know that like the old porcelain dolls were made of asbestos. Hi, Blade. So good to see you. How are ya? Um, <clears throat> do you buy these haunted things from, are they haunted? I think you're trying to ask, do I know if they're haunted? So sometimes I have a, a really big feeling that there's something attached, like the voodoo doll in California. Kelsey and I immediately knew that there was something not good attached to it. Other times I kind of buy it because I'm like, okay, maybe I'll, I'll test it out with some of my equipment or it just kind of looks cool. Not everything I own is haunted, um, but the confirmed dolls that you frequently see on my channel, like Hansel Gretel Scratch and my Haunted Clown Jack, those are confirmed haunted. I've been working with them for a long time. I also have two other uh, vintage Jack in the Boxes, a very strange baby doll vintage as well, and a very old Bozo the Clown. I don't feel anything from those, which is why I don't film with them too much. It's kind of just for show. And then, yeah, if you guys are just joining, this right here is my vintage Shirley Temple doll turned clown, and her face got burned. And then, of course, we've got my little baby doll. And, oh, I have Jack. I got Jack. <gasps> I almost ripped my nail off trying to save her life and I ripped her freaking hair off, but you could see her original hair. She's so mad at me right now. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay. So here, thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate you. Um, and then we got devil girl right here. If you guys are just joining, um, but I want to show you guys <clears throat> the little clown that I got back here. I believe this is from the year 1971. Um, immediately saw this when I walked into the thrift store. This is another thrift store in PA. This is an Anna Lee antique clown. But, but I don't know. I'm totally obsessed with clowns. You guys know I can't get enough. Literally cannot get enough. So we're going to throw them back here. We'll toss them back there. We'll hold baby doll. Um, we got a couple more orders. So let me go ahead and read those off. Oh my God. We have a couple. Yeah. We got a lot of orders here, guys. So shout out to Jennifer guys. We're going to sell out of these cat crystals tonight. I'm going to check real quick to see how many we got left, but I'm pretty sure we're getting close to, I'm pretty sure we're getting there. So shout out to Jennifer W. And shout out to Sarah, Sarah B. And shout out to Sarah B. Got the kitty cat crystals. And then we got Sunshine B. Sunshine B. Okay. Cool name. Cool name. And we got Magnus F. I'm going to check how many, and they got some kitty cat crystals. Okay. Let's see how many of the kitty cat crystals we have left. We have 160 starlings. Here's, here's, here's guys. <laughs> what is going on? I don't know. Okay. Let me check the kitty cat crystals. <clears throat> We have about 20 of the little cats left and all of the cat paw crystals are officially sold out. So we only have about 20 of these left, guys. Can we sell out on tonight's live stream? That would definitely mean the absolute world. Okay. How many haunted places have you been to? Oh my goodness. Hundreds, hundreds. I wouldn't even know like a number, like just quite literally hundreds. Let me show you guys a couple of my other favorite crystals that are a part of this restock. This one I kept, I kept a piece for myself. This is half raw cut purple fluorite. 
Do you see that? Do you see like the shimmer in there? And then look at the side, right? And then look at the back of that. So it has a little bit of green fluorite with the purple fluorite. This piece, guys, is the most magical piece I feel like I've ever sold. And the lighting is not even doing it justice. But do you see that? If you go to my store, you will see this. This is a half bra cut purple fluorite crystal tower. And I believe that there's only three of these left. Then we have some feathered fluorite. So very similar, but when you hold these up to light, you will actually see the uh, crystal inclusions inside of them. Not like every single crystal is different. So um, you guys can go ahead and pick your piece. These are numbered. So when checking out, you'll be able to pick the piece that you want, but this is a purple and green fluorite tower. Then we have some hematoid quartz. This right here is super magical. It's powerful as hell. It's a, a huge protection crystal, hematoid quartz or fire quartz. Then we have the sunstone tower. This one shimmers in the sunlight and this is the stone of joy and happiness. I absolutely love this one. And we have a couple more orders. I'm going to read those in just a second, but I wanted to show you guys a couple other crystals right here. I'm actually shocked. I don't even know if I sold any of these yet. And this one right here, I, I absolutely love. So hopefully, hopefully somebody here picks one of these up. Let's see. So I love raw crystals. This is raw kyanite. But do you see that, guys? It shimmers. It has these like silver. It has these like silver pieces that shimmer in the sunlight. It like in natural light, it just looks so insane. But I have different pieces that you guys can choose from. Do you kind of see this one on this side? It has like the silver shimmer. So blue is amazing for your throat throat chakra. Clearly I need it because I can never speak properly. Um, but if you guys are having trouble, like expressing yourself, kyanite is really good for self-expression as well. Um, and I just love the raw crystals. The raw crystals are always my favorite or when they're like half raw like this, like a half raw crystal. I just absolutely love those. It, it just reminds me of the earth. I love the polished and the carvings, but the polished crystals and the carved crystals, but there's just something about a raw crystal. And then I still have some of these little rose quartz bunnies left. I will be restocking more bunnies in this restock coming up though. So if you guys want a bunny, I will have more. I believe there's only three of these left. A couple of you guys got these blue last, uh, last. I can't speak. I cannot. Um, so this is a Druzy blue lace Aggie tart. Do you see the Druzy inside of it? The like open geode with the speckly sparkly pieces. Yeah. Bunch of you guys just pick those up. Then we have these gorgeous carnelian stars. Carnelian is passion. Love. Look at these guys. Look at those. So we got some carnelian stars. And this is moss agate growing with pyrite. This is a very powerful crystal. The pyrite is the gold that you see there. Pyrite is known as fool's gold. It's for abundance, prosperity. Moss agate is a stone of new beginnings and creativity. These two together are incredibly powerful. And the fact that they grow together is insanity to me. Insanity. So this is moss agate growing with pyrite. Let's see what else do we got. Oh, we have these little goddess bodies that I think are just the cutest little thing. Um, so we have these little goddess bodies. This is a moss agate goddess body. So we have some of those. You guys can pick the one that you want. We have sky blue quartz. Sky blue quartz. The light is not helping me out here. And then we have a rhodonite. Rhodonite goddess body as well. Um, and then... We have the serpentine one, which is actually my favorite. I'm obsessed with the green. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> these are, I like these ones. Um, and then we have moss agate eagle's head. I love all the animals. Little dream amethyst mushroom. Look at that, guys. Dream amethyst. This is for opening your third eye, strengthening your psychic abilities. Also great for anxiety and stress release release relief oh and then 
guys, this one's really cool. I really only sell crystals that don't have any like pieces attached to them. But when I saw this, I was like, I need to get this. So this is a amethyst butterfly. Look how cute those are. And they stand. Look how cute that is, guys. Is that cute? <laughs> the cutest thing. And then what else? What else? Oh, I have tons and tons and tons of bracelets, guys. So tons of bracelets. This is Ruby Honeycomb, Honeycomb, Honeycomb Ruby. This seems to be super popular right now. These are selling out pretty quick. I'll show you guys some of the bracelets. And then I'm going to go through the orders here and see if we got any more orders because I do believe we got a couple more orders here. So we have some purple Mika and we also have some Dream Amethyst bracelets. You guys know I always have my crystal bracelets on. These ones are cool. I don't know if I'll be able to get them again. These might actually be sold out. This is Black Obsidian with Evil Eye Beads. Super powerful. Powerful as fuck. We got some blue, sky blue Chalcedony. These ones right here, gorgeous color blue. We have a couple of these turquoise ones left. Some turquoise bracelets. I like these because they're all different variations of colors. Then we have some tur uh, turquoise. We have some tiger's eye and you guys love these. Um, this is for protection. I have protection bracelets for days. I'm going to show you guys a couple more here. <laughs> Unicorn. Unicorn bracelet. This is like five different crystals in one. These remind me of cotton candy. These are a, quite the popular, quite the popular ones. Then we have some blue appetite bracelets. These sold out like crazy last time. And then as always, I am giving away one of these black tourmaline bracelets in this live stream protection. Always got to have a black tourmaline bracelet. I think everybody in the world should be wearing one, to be honest. Carnelian. Carnelian. Passion. Love. So that's basically everything I wanted to show you guys. I really hope somebody grabs up this gorgeous, gorgeous, high quality amethyst piece, because if you don't, I'm keeping it for myself. <laughs> But I'd rather somebody have it because I can always get one of these, you know, and yeah, do I have any opalites? I think all of the opalite I just had has officially sold, but I typically have opalite moon etched towers in stock. So I will probably be restocking those in my restock this upcoming weekend. <sighs> okay, I think we have a couple more orders here. So let me just go ahead and see what we got. And thanks so much for hanging out with me tonight, guys. Guys, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Oh, hello, Courtney Joe. Where have you been? Bad Swede. Hey, hey. Thank you so much for the super chat. Appreciate you. Okay, so we have a couple more orders here. We actually have quite a few. So I left off with Magnus. And we got Amanda L., so Amanda L, guys, we have like 20 more cat crystals. Can we sell those out in this live stream? Because that literally would pay for half of that surgery right there for Oliver, who was shot with the BB gun. Also, guys, there is a GoFundMe link in the description of this video. $5, $10, whatever you can send. If this cat cannot get surgery on Wednesday, it, it will lose its leg. And that's that's a fact. Unfortunately, the vets don't care. They want their freaking money. And I wish that there was like lower, low cost clinics that were available in more areas, but unfortunately they are not. And the surgery is going to be about $4,000. So shout out to Amanda L. Oh, I'm so excited to pick names, guys. I love, that's like my favorite part is picking the names. We got Amanda L. We got Mary Kay again. And we got Todd L. Todd has purchased from me before. Todd L. And we got Brianna again. Oh, I need another page of paper, guys. We have 170 starlings. Yay. Brianna N. She 
Sheba S. Shout out to Sheba S. And I believe you guys are all purchasing up the cats. Oh my God. You guys are literally all getting the cat crystals. I think we might actually sell all the cat crystals. And shout out to Amy P. Cool. Okay. Let's check what we got left for the kitty cats. We have... Okay, guys, we still have about 20 left. So if we can get all of these cats sold, like I said, I am positive that we can get more than half the money for Oliver's surgery. So, oh my gosh, I have so many crystals in front of me. It's like madness. I have haunted dolls and crystals freaking everywhere. <sighs> yeah, I don't understand why people do what they do to animals. I, I never would know like or understand, but I think... I think the beauty in the situation, if there's any, or the beauty or the positive of the situation is that there are people that are willing to help like you and me. And, you know, I'll always do what I can to support the cats. And I've been looking for a, a cat colony to uh, support for a long time now. And the fact that I can do it with my outreach on social media and by selling crystals, it, it just, I'm just so grateful. I'm grateful. Like I truly am. I just want to be able to help and give back in any way I can. And you know, it's not always easy because obviously I have bills and I have my travel full time to, to film content basically. But when I can, I absolutely am always giving my last little bit of money to help a, a, a cat organization here or there. You know, it's just, I, lo I love animals. They're the purest, purest beings that exist here on earth. Shout out to Cecile. We got Cecile and she got a cat crystal. Aha. So we got Cecile. Go on Prime on people that hurts animals. Oh, I don't. I don't like watching anything. What is your tattoo, Courtney? What is your tattoo, Courtney? I need to know. Okay, so we got that. We got that. We got that. Just putting away the crystal towers. Just want to make sure I got all the free crystals set up and lined up and ready to roll for when I start pulling names. I'm going to grab Jack in just a few minutes so I can start cutting up the names, throwing them in the little box, and we will start choosing some names. I'm going to I'm going to go for a little while longer, uh, hang out with you guys for a little bit longer. But yeah, we have quite a few orders still coming in right now. I sent it to you. Oh, right now? The new doll has something attached to her, doesn't she? You know, I feel, I feel out of this, you know, the clown that I got and this doll and this doll, I, I really do feel like this doll has something with her only because of where I purchased her from, an incredibly haunted location. They said the doll wasn't haunted. Doesn't mean that something didn't attach to it or was interested in attaching to it, especially if it saw the doll leaving. Just, uh, you know, possibility here, but I will definitely be doing some mini investigations on my TikTok. So she is from New Hope PA, a store called the Creeper Gallery. Very, very haunted location. <sighs> Have I ever been physically hurt by spirit? I've been scratched, but I've never been like physically harmed. I have been oppressed. I have had, had, I have had, had, I've had a very dark attachment for a while um, that luckily, thankfully, I was able to nip in the butt last year, but it wasn't like a possession. It was just like an attachment where it affected everything in my life and it was really hard to function. So I don't know what to do with him. Like, ah, I don't know. Okay, this doll is gonna fall over and probably break all my massive crystal towers back there. Thank you so much for the super chat. So here, I really appreciate you a lot supporting me as always. Ah. Gotta come back to Long Island, check out Mary's house. 
Mary's house. I wonder if I'm able to uh, get in there for like an overnight. The voodoo doll is still in my storage unit in LA. Just did a video yesterday with some updates and spirit box communication with him. So go check that video out. Jackie boy in the back, just be chilling. Yeah. Jackie boy, the homie. Oh, got the funniest responses, guys, in my last video. Um, I I don't know who it was. Maybe the, the entity of the voodoo doll. But the spirit box quite literally said, Jack is quite absurd. It said, Jack is quite absurd. Go watch it, guys. Those responses were insane. Insane. Okay, so we got Billy. Yes. Hi, Billy. Good to see you. Thanks for coming by. And he purchased uh, a kitty cat crystal. Guys, we're so close to selling out of the cat crystals. And again... We got shout out to John S. Oops. And again, the GoFundMe for Oliver the, for Oliver the cat will be in the description as well. Hey, Chris, I placed an order for one of your kid kidneys. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, it is it is comical watching me talk. I'll tell you that. That was yeah. Um, shout out to Crystal B again. Uh, Brittany, I definitely got you on there, I'm sure. If you purchased, I will go through and read everybody's name. Yeah, Brittany S got you on there. So shout out to Crystal B again. Okay. How many dolls do I have? That's a great question because I don't even know. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Like ten to twelve. Maybe more. <laughs> you have three haunted dolls. You'll have to send me a picture of them. What's the best crystal for protection? Um, so hematite, wearing a hematite ring, which is what I have on my thumb right here. Um, hematite, black obsidian, black onyx, black tourmaline. Any of your darker crystals absorb dark, dense energy. Tiger's eye is a good one as well. You know, that's interesting. You're right, Amy. The spirit box did say that there were 10 spirits here. I'm not saying every doll I own is haunted, but there are a couple resident ghosts that live here and have been here my entire life. So definitely think there's somewhere around 10 because there's a lot that goes on here in my house. <sighs> my goodness. Okay, so we got two Lisas. We have Lisa R and Lisa C. They have purchased from me before. Thank you guys so much. I'm telling you, I'm having an allergy attack from this old Charlie Chaplin porcelain doll. It's not good. It needs to be in a glass case. Oh, God, I'm having an allergy attack. Lisa C, and I'm pretty sure we are getting close to selling out of these kitty cats. Oh my goodness. Gosh, guys. Wow. 55 orders basically in this live stream. I'm going to be packing all of your orders tomorrow. And uh, again, every order gets freebies. And after this live stream is over, if you guys want a chance to win a big crystal amethyst crystal tree, all you have to do is comment your email down below so that I can reach you. Um, I'm just going to need it so I can reach out to you and get your address. And that goes for anybody if you've made a purchase or not. So that goes for anybody. Again, just to clarify, um, if you do purchase during this live stream, you are entered into win one of the many crystals that I am giving away. Writing down the names here, I'm going to be throwing them in Jack's box in just a few. Okay. Ooh, my nose. 
Yes, I do have siblings. I have a brother and two sisters. Do the doll spirits ever fight? You know, there are spirits that sound like they're fighting in my hallway quite often. I will say it wakes me up pretty frequently. It's like mumbling and like loud, aggressive arguing in a way. And sometimes I have to tell them to shut the F up. And I, I, I feel crazy, but other people have heard it too. No, I'm not sick, but I'm having a minor allergy attack. I believe from the Charlie Chaplin doll. I don't even want to pick him up and touch him. Um, but this guy that I got recently with all of the other new dolls that I'm adding to my wild ass collection. It's definitely him. Look, I put him near me and I'm about to sneeze. There's definitely asbestos in here. He's like, not, he's not good. <sighs> 175 people here. I want to put him somewhere for you guys to see him. But honestly, I just, I can't because you're not, he's going to fall over. He need, I can't even breathe. He needs to go. Adios, amigo. Get out of here. I work at a thrift store that I know is haunted, but the owners won't give me permission to investigate. I think because it would have to be after hours. Oh, man. See, I don't know why they wouldn't just be down with that. I feel like that would bring more people to the store. More people are going to want to go because they're like intrigued by the paranormal activity. You know, I, my dream, guys, I want to own like an antique shop, like a not just an antique shop, shop, but like a thrift store where I have like the coolest thrifted pieces like Love Saves the Day, where I got this piece from, where I sell like my own personal stuff and just things I've collected over the years. And I'm really good at finding stuff as well. And yeah, I would definitely open it up for nighttime investigations. 100%. 100% and I would sell like confirmed haunted items that would be under investigation for periods of time before I even sold them, you know? All right, we have another order here. I'm going to start cutting up the names here, here, guys. So we got Todd L again and we have Pearl S. And Todd got some of the little baby kitty cats. And we got Pearl S. Okay. I will be right back, guys. Um, I'm going to start cutting up the names to put in Jack's box. And we're going to pull the names so I can start giving away these crystals for you guys. And, yeah, if you want to get an order in, I would do it super soon. We have a couple more of the little kitty cat crystals. And if we can get all of those sold, it would make my night, my week, my month. So, super appreciate you guys. I just got to grab some scissors. I will be right back. And hopefully I don't trip over all these wires. Make sure that this is an antique chair, by the way, and an antique pillow that I got to go with it. Okay, I'll be right back. All right, guys, I am back. I am back with Jack. <laughs> Hello, everybody just joining. Is Jeff serenading Kai? I believe so. Oh, Amy, <laughs> you're so sweet. I love how you pay attention to that. That that was a good comment right there. Yes, he's in there playing guitar. Um, he will definitely be a bonus for a spiritual series. <laughs> yeah, you know. This, this doll, I'm pretty sure I'm having an allergic reaction to him. The doll on the left is staring creepy. That's, that's a wild combination right there. <laughs> if you get an antique shop, you, you're just going to end up living there. You know what? My house is an antique store in itself. And there's so much that I want to do because I live in such a cool little house. And everybody that comes here says that they're like, you have the coolest setup. I want to start putting stuff on the walls more, like more so than I have. Um, I want to get like some shelves to display my, my findings. Let's see. Do we have any more orders? I'm going to pull the names in just a moment here. So hang tight guys. Yeah. I'm having like an allergy attack. That is for certain. Okay. How am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? Oh, and by the way, thank you for the super chat, Bad Swede. Um, hey, Chris, I'm the one who sent you the Moss Agate Ghost. Oh my God. Yes. I've been wondering who sent that to me. 
Was that your store? Or did you order that from somebody on Etsy? Because that Moss Agate Ghost is my favorite crystal that I own. When I got that in the mail in my PO box, I thought for a second maybe I ordered it and I didn't remember. Maybe you told me that you had already ordered it. And thank you so much for the super chat. I I love it. It is my favorite piece. That is the best ghost crystal. I wish that I can source them somewhere so I can sell them because I love it. I want everybody to have one. I, I want to find more ghosts, but it's hard finding them when it's not around like Halloween time. But yeah, I I super appreciate that. That that made me really, really happy. Okay. Hopefully. Ah. Ah. Wavy Styles. Shout out to Wavy Styles. Shout out to Wavy Styles. Okay. So I just ripped. Ah. I ripped a couple of these names. I have to rewrite them. Hold on, guys. One second. Gotta rewrite Lisa R, Lisa C. Lisa R, Lisa C, Todd L, and I think Pearl is okay, and Kenna. Kenna C. All right, so let's call it um, 9 15. I'm going to pull names. So if you guys want to get any more orders in, uh, definitely do that before then. I'm going to start picking these up and I'm going to chat with you guys in the meantime. Do I like the spirit talker or the necro device? Um, honestly, they both do very similar things. So we got Pearl. They both do very similar things. I kind of like them. I like the Necrophonic app more because you do get more responses. But the Spirit Talker app is really, really interesting. Because sometimes the way that that comes through is absolutely insane. I have a lot of really haunted dolls. How can I tell if they're haunted? Um, usually, you know, what I try to do is, since I am really sensitive to the energy, I like to take some time to try to tap into the energy, but I would just recommend downloading the Necrophonic app and seeing if there's any responses that come through. You can also get, um, ooh, you can also get some dowsing rods and EMF meter. EMF meters are fairly inexpensive on Amazon and those detect EMF frequencies um, near certain objects. And if it lights up, then you most likely have something going on. Looks like some of you guys have some ghost equipment already. Let me know what you guys do have. I see people have the dousing rods. I see people have the EMF meters. The clown in the back reminds me of the one from the original Poltergeist movie. Yeah. Yeah, that's what somebody said before. Ah, I'll watch that movie. Maybe I'll watch it tonight. I've been on like a horror movie, here, but like old school classics like It and The Shining and trying to think what else I recently watched. Children of the Corn. So here, thank you for the super chat again. All right, so I'm gonna have a huge mess to clean up, but it's so good. Okay, we have a couple more minutes if you guys wanna get your orders in. And I'm just gonna cut up these names here. And I did get everybody, I always double check and make sure that everybody's written down. If you guys purchase more than once, your name is definitely on here more than once. I do occasionally use a pendulum as well. I have not uh, used one in a really long time, but I it's a very easy thing to use. Would recommend that as well. Those you can also get on Amazon. Let me know if you guys would like me to make an Amazon storefront where you guys can shop some of the items that I frequently use, like EMF meter, REM pod, pendulums, dowsing rods, uh, tarot cards this way. You know, I, I know when I was first starting out, I had a lot of questions as to where to buy this stuff and what specifically to buy. So this kind of, I can just add everything to a list of what I typically use. And then you guys would have just like a solidified list and a place to go and purchase these things. That would be amazing. Yeah, that would be helpful AF. Cool. 
I will definitely do that for you guys then. It'll be in my link tree. Um, I will keep, I'll put it in every video that I post on YouTube, but if you guys follow me on Instagram and TikTok and Twitter, I will, my link tree is in the bio of every single social media account that I have. And that has links to like everything that I do, like my crystal shop. I'll put the, the Amazon storefront in there as well. Okay. Jack be looking like a snack tonight. Jack says, hello, Courtney. Jack says, hi. All right, we are almost done. Guys, I'm pulling names in five minutes and I am so excited to see who is going to win some of these fabulous crystals. And Patreon, yeah guys, if you didn't know, I have a Patreon. It's basically a little community where you can come and support me. I have a Discord chat where I chat with you guys. Sometimes I post tarot card readings. I do have a tier for monthly crystal goodie boxes with different things in them, like Sage. I write personal notes for you guys. Um, a, tier, a tier for tarot card readings. And I will put that in the description of this video as well. So if you want to come over and join the community that we got going on, we have Caitlin here. We have so here, Billy. There's a ton of you guys that are part of my Patreon. And I really um, I appreciate you guys so much. That really helps me out. Oh, we got another order here. Oh, dropped one name. Let me just make sure that I pick that up. Yeah, sometimes Courtney posts pictures of us on FaceTime that are very unappealing. So if you guys want to see like some pretty comical raw shots of me, you know, making the dumbest of faces, then yeah, join the Patreon. But yeah, I will leave the Patreon link in the description, guys. But you can just find me patreon.com slash, I believe it's Chris Starr. I'll just search my name and you'll see it. Okay, everybody's name is in. I believe we have one more order. We have four more minutes. So shout out to Wilson. Shout out to, where's my pen? Wilson T. And let's see what Wilson got. Wilson got a kitty cat crystal. Yay. Okay, so guys, we have three minutes. We're pulling names in three minutes. And I will be checking every minute until then. And again, after this live stream, I will be giving away this huge crystal tree. So if you guys want a chance to win that, that goes for everybody who purchased or didn't purchase. All you have to do is comment your email below after this live stream. That's it. This way I can email you to get your address and I'll ship it off to Mara. Okay. Three minutes. Roll up. Let's go. Okay. These are the last and final names. Unless we got any more in the next three minutes. And then we are done. Okay. I'm going to mix the names around just to make it kind of fair. We have some in the back. We have some in the front. Some in the back. Some in the front. Jack likes when we pick names out of his box. He gets up. A... I'm sorry, Jackie boy. I just hit him in his head. Um, how many kitty cat crystals left? Let us, let us check. I don't know. It's not working. Two more minutes, guys, and I'm picking winners for the crystals. Um, guys, we only have 12 kitty cat crystals left, only 12 left. So we can get these sold out. That's going to be like half, half that money is going to pay for Oliver's surgery. And again, yeah, Jack's forehead, um, the GoFundMe for the cat that was shot with the BB gun will be in the description of this video. So if you guys want to go and support additionally there, that link will be there as well. And yeah, hopefully we can raise all of the funds by Wednesday. I believe it's about $3,900, $4,000. It is damn expensive, but he needs it. He really does. So one more minute and I'm going to pull some names. So we got Peggy. 
Peggy O. And she got a kitty cat crystal. So we got Peggy O. Peggy, are you going to be the last person? Peggy might be the last person to be added to Jack's box. <laughs> okay. Are we ready, guys? We're going to pick. We're going to pick the winners in just a moment. I'm going to start small and work my way up to the biggest crystal, which is the Florate Moon and Star Etch Tower. Okay, guys, that is it. Okay, so I've officially stopped taking names for the crystal giveaway. And I'm going to do the bracelets first. So we have two powerful bracelets, the carnelian and the black tourmaline. I'm telling you, that doll, it really is screwing me up. So we're going to do the carnelian bracelet first. And of course, every single order, guys, gets freebies regardless, okay? So you're going to get something extra in your order regardless. So first for the carnelian bracelet, this is passion, love, really powerful crystal. Here we go. Let's pull a name out of Jack's box. We got Bricks, Brixie H, Brixie H. So I'm going to start a little pile here. So we got Brixie H, got the carnelian. Now we're going to do the black tourmaline bracelet. This is for protection, spiritual protection. Everybody should have one. I do have those in stock, guys. Um, those typically sell out pretty fast, but I try to get them every restock. So this is for the black tourmaline bracelet. And this is going to Amanda L. Amanda L. Why can't you guys see that? I don't know why. Amanda L. Oh my God, guys, we are giving away a lot of freaking crystals tonight. Let's do the little turtles. So we have the green jade turtle. This is going to Sunshine B. Sunshine B. The light is drowning out the names that I'm picking, so it's okay. Um, okay, let's do the little Moss Agate Tower right here. Let's do the little Moss Agate Tower. We got Billy V. Billy, who is a patron of mine. He has been supporting me for a very, very long time. So, Billy, you got one of my personal pieces. This is from my personal collection. So, shout out to Billy. Okay. So, this will be for the Florite Moon in Etched Star Tower. Gorgeous piece. It is massive. It is huge, as you guys can see. Look how big that is. Okay. Let us see. This is going to... Ah! Crystal B and Crystal did purchase multiple things in this live stream. I saw her name multiple times. So yeah, Crystal B. Oh, all I have to do is move in a little bit, but the screen is inverted. So shout out to Crystal B. Now let's do the Sodalite Tower and Tower. Sodalite Tree and the little Fluorite Tree with the Angel Aura on the bottom. Angel Aura Quartz. So dun, dun, dun. All right, guys, let's see. Who are we going to pick? Todd L. Todd L. Todd purchased multiple times in this in this live stream as well. Todd has purchased many times before. Todd, I'm going to give you the blue soda light angel aura tree. And last and final one, I believe. Let's see. Oh, my God. This is going to Sheba S. Sheba. Ah, Sheba S. So Sheba S is going to get the little um, angel or a fluorite tree. So we got everybody's names here. Guys, thank you so much for purchasing during this live stream. Again, every single cat crystal that you see in my store is going to helping save Oliver the cat's life who was shot with a BB gun. Okay, so with that that just means the world to us. Um, as soon as I tell the lady who's in charge of the cat colony that you guys basically bought out every single cat crystal, she is going to freak out. 
Um, and also I will put her TikTok in the description of this video if you guys want to go and follow her just to see the updates and the different cats that we support in the cat colony. Um, but yeah, congratulations, guys. Yes, I, I will keep you posted, D. I'll post some updates. And yeah, thank you, guys. I really appreciate you. Yeah, Sheba, congrats. Congrats to everybody that won these crystals. Now, if you guys want to win a larger amethyst crystal tree, angel aura crystal tree, all you have to do is comment after this video is over down below in the comments with your email, and I will be choosing a winner tomorrow. I will notify you by email. This way I can get your address and I can ship off your crystal. Every single order that was placed tonight will get freebies as always. And I just, I appreciate you guys. Thanks for hanging out with us. That was so fun. How do you th send things in PO box? I will put the my PO box in the description of this video as well, but it typically is in every single description of every video that I do post here on my YouTube channel. Yes, congrats to everybody. Whew. If you guys want to see me do some mini investigations with my new Shirley Temple doll and the devil's doll in the background, follow me on TikTok because I will be there this week posting videos with these little weirdos. You give off the best vibes. Love your videos. Thank you so much, Chloe. I will do GoFundMe. Thank you so much, So Here. She will really, really appreciate that. Honestly, I think with all of the crystals I sold tonight and the amount of money that we've already gotten on the GoFundMe, well, we haven't gotten a lot on the GoFundMe. We've only gotten like $400, but if we can get a little bit more on the GoFundMe, I think we will be set for Wednesday. But I will leave some, I will, I'll post some updates about the kitty. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to head out because I have so many orders to pack. I'm probably going to start packing some orders tonight and then tomorrow and then all of your goodies will be shipped off with all of your um, crystals that you guys just won and some freebies. And I got to clean up this mess and get these dolls the fuck out of my room because they're going. They're, they're going. They're not staying in here. Well, actually, Hansel and Gretel and Scratch do stay in here. Stupidly enough. <laughs> anyway, um, love you guys so much. And all of my links for everything, my crystal shop, my Patreon, the GoFundMe for the cat, uh, my PO box and my TikTok will be in the description of this video. And don't forget to go and comment after this video is over with your email so that I can pick a winner for the larger crystal tray. All right. Peace out guys. And I will talk to you guys super soon. Bye.